what's up youtube what's up guys so welcome back to the channel so today video so today we try out the m13b so if you guys didn't know m13b had a buff in season two so let me show you guys the screen right now so right here this is the m13b right here they did something in season two uh last season i could just say that but even it was like season two reloader but anyway right here it say increased damage at mid range uh increased open total damage so this is what they did in season two yes and i'm gonna show you guys the patch though in season three where they actually did to the m13b Boy, this is crazy though, for real. This is insane. Right here, it's an M13B got a headshot damage slightly reduced. Then they did some right here to the low torso damage increase, mid range damage, uh, distance increase, and upper toy damage slightly reduced. So they buffed this gun. Same time, nerf. I mean, they did nerf the headshots as well. But at the same time, if you guys watch my videos, I was talking about the, you know, Tackle 56, Valley 46, uh, what else? Uh, uh, what was uh, the Vast Nines as well? You know, yeah, they, they nerfed the headshot, but at the same time, you don't have to worry about it because it's still good. It's still good. That's all I'm going to say, though, man. For real, though, man. So we tried the M13B. We got some crazy game plays today, man, with the M13B. This class ass shot today. Oh, my God. I, I had to say this. I had to say this, man. Look at this. The buff golly gun. I'm telling you, guys, after update, man, this gun is like golly. Might as well. It got a buff. They just, people were saying it kept buffing this gun. I mean, even though in season one, this was a DLC weapon, but you had to get this DLC weapon in like, you know, DMZ. And now they kind of change it now. So when you go to the, you know, DMZ, somebody could drop the gun for you and then you leave. You know, an airplane or a helicopter, wherever. I said helicopter, my bad. Oh, I could say helicopter or plane, but it's helicopter. You know, take off and you got the blueprint. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I had to say this, man. In season one, they didn't touch this gun. But like I said, season one, it was a DLC weapon. Season one reloader, still DLC weapon, they didn't touch it. Season two, they touched it. Season two reloader, they didn't touch it. And season three, they buffed this gun. I'm telling you guys, this gun is so good. Like I said, we got two gameplays. Two gameplays was crazy. Shipping, shipment. I'm sorry, man. I know I could have just played other game mode, but tomorrow I might do that because I, I do have another video I might gonna do. Maybe the, you know what I'm saying, Lockman Sub. So if you guys didn't know, Lockman Sub had a buff too, but they only buffed the three round birth. I can't wait to use that because I already seen other people make videos of their gun. And with the three round birth, it's just straight up insane though, for real though. But I'm gonna go to the fire ray. This class headed chart today is just so good, man. I love this gun a lot, man. It kind of reminded me of the M13 from, you know, Modern for 2018, even though it is the M13, you know, but it's called the M13B. And then Modern for 2018 is called the M13. But yeah, I mean, it's just like, but at the same time, I know how it's feeling when people think like, you know, how you. You could tell, like, when you use the gun, you're like, dang, it don't, it, it's probably not the same, just like the one from Modern for 2018, you know. I mean, it's what it is, what it is, though. But it's still good. It's still good, though. It's good they buffed this gun, though. But I got a good class, so even though this kind of slow, but, I mean, it's, it's just too good, man. Like, look at this. It's just too good, man. Everybody really enjoyed this gun. And it's crazy. It got a buff in Season 2. Now, Season 3, just crazy, though. We got two gameplays, like I said. First video, we dropped 80 plus kills. Second video, I think we dropped, like... I don't even know, man. Just, just enjoy the gameplay, man. If you guys do the channel, drop a like and subscribe. Roll to 600 subscribers on the channel. Upload every single day a Modern Warfare 2 content, a best class of the tricks, tips, high kill gameplays. If you guys like to see blueprints and the battle pass in the store, drop a like and subscribe. Yeah, man. This class setup, man. I'm telling you guys, you guys gotta try it out. Let me know, comment below if you try this out. I'll show you guys the class in the, the video. But further ado, let's get right to the gameplay. Before this video start, I want you guys to do me a favor. Follow me on social media on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Trying to get more followers on her, get more active on her. If you guys do that for me, man, I will follow it back for you guys like that and stuff. I'm trying to get more followers, man. If you guys give me like 100 followers on Twitter, and I can say TikTok, 100 followers, and then we, can we get 1,000 followers on Instagram? You know, if you guys do that for me, it really means a lot. You know, and I really appreciate for all the support like that, Fredo. But Fredo, dude, let's get right to the video. Uh, let's go with a sniping. Fredo, go Kishun. I don't know where you is. My teammate with shotguns. One more. Come on, one more. There you go, man. There you go. That's all I need. That one more kill. Just to add up. But I don't want to challenge that. Oh. Oh, they got center right there. I don't want to challenge that.
up. Alright, here. Oh, good job, teammate. Let's go right there with a down gun. Sniper, bro. Good job. Got a gun. Oh, this guy's sitting here. Ryan Shield. And I get freaking. Got shine to hit quick, bro. I get shot by RPG, are you serious? All right, let me call my veto then. Get over there. Got, and I get killed by my veto. And we love that, man. I, I see why people like the support helo better than the chopper gun, because, got, got, look at this dude, weird. I see why people like the, the, uh, they all in there. They are in there, man. Oh, he's sitting there. It's weird, bro. Bro, don't want to move. Stand in the damn corner. No, come on, bro. If my teammate was not in the way, man. Jesus. Teammate's in the way every time. Channel, channel. Oh my god, then you can't. Oh, I almost died. Wait, what? I survived it. Yeah, okay, I died. All right. I survived it and I died. Great. That's wonderful. We love that. We, we definitely love that. Go with her. We definitely, we definitely love that, man. And I try to kill this dude. Go right there. I got a veto up. I'll have to call my chopper gun in a minute. And I died by the veto. They got a veto too. Throw this over here just in case. All right. They ain't gonna be happy when I call this in. I gotta kill my bouncy belly. That's good. They ain't gonna be happy when I call this in. Oh, they are in the container. Look, look at him. Try to hide in the container, bro. Trying to hide in the container. So instead, trying to hide in the container, bro. I see him. Yo, he still look, look at him. He still trying to hide in the container. It's that same person who got the veto. Same person trying to get the veto. Challenge, teammate challenge. Don't be scared, man. Put us right here.
Camp because they're getting the vetoes, getting the shrieks. Oh. My veto right there. And I'm dead. Oh my god, why they gotta target me? Veto. This guy, man, it's two people RPGs. Put over there. Two people with vetoes. Too many RPGs. Put over there, put over there. Veto's annoying. Oh, mom's in right now. Let me get that shotty. Yep, no, this dude right there. This guy with this damn RPG. Oh, this guy in a container chilling. Yo, and I died. This dude come around. He been coming here. Yo, he's dead. Got you. Go right there. And this guy in the container, man, just chilling. Just sitting in the container, chilling, bro. Just sitting in the container, chilling, bro. Are you serious? Look, stay in there. Put it right there. Put it right here, just in case. What are you just keep doing, bro? What are you doing, son? Oh my god. Come here. I just got her this magnet. Over here. I just got with this RPG, bro. Oh my god. RPG, man. Throw this up. Oh, I missed that. Yup. Oh, I rid of my gun. Can see smoke. Oh my god, bro. Alright, there's her. Have a damn RPG. And I died. Oh my god, bro. Let's go, man. 85 plus kills, man, with the M13B buff. Yeah, I know they're gonna switch spawns. Come on now. Most thing I know about switch spawns. And it guys been my teammate late, so late, bro. So late, bro. Teammate so late for that, man. I mean, so freaking late. This guy got RPG and LMG. The most thing getting on this kid sitting with an LMG to sprint. Got lay on the ground. Most thing I don't know, we got people laying on the ground.
can't freaking move. Sit down and run shit right here. The blow shield me. So lay on the ground. Scott, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing? That's what I want to know. Using the damn LMG. Soon. And my damn teammate Ryan Shield. Come on, bro. Come on, man. Teammate, bro. Oh, my God. Just literally on my good streak right now, man. On my good streak. I mean, on a good streak right now, bro. On a good streak, man. I mean, on a good streak. Where am I gonna? I'm in on a good streak right now. Definitely going to response too. This guy going to throw a whole grenade over there. Jesus. When they switch spawns, bro, why would you come this way? The most annoying thing is in this game. The spawns. Look, look at this dude. Got PvP. Where is that one thing in the game? Look at this guy, kept spraying, just staying in one spot. Just throwing grenades. Gotta get this kill off this head, cause he just sitting there. There you go, gotta get him off the head. And it's always another person peek through. Look at this dude. Look, this dude gonna keep looking at him. Just keep pushing the spot. Keep pushing the down spot. Chilling. I mean, I was on a good streak, bro. Dude, I right here trying to drop shot.
Oh, look at this dude. Just keep spraying and sitting there. Man. Look at this guy, freaking RPG. Oh, there's a person. bro 55 kill it's cool though man bro at least we got a little bit of street you can tell it's a clan camping that's probably why all right guys all right youtube so today make sure you guys the best buff golly gun in modern first 2 man we got the m13b in season 3 man yes man they got a buff and if you guys remember season 2 this gun had a buff as well but hey these two gameplays I hope you guys enjoy. If you guys do, drop a like and subscribe. This class up. It's a straight up banger. Show you guys the class up. So in the very we got the 14 burn uh Ashton line. This is actually a good very you got guitar right there on the pro. Got the damage ring, full of velocity, hit fire accuracy, got the recoil control. This is actually a good barrel, man. I'm telling you guys, like you got damage and bullet of velocity. And plus you can hair fire players and you got recoil control. It's very, very good. So try it. I'm sure you guys tune So the tuners on this, we got the recoil steadiness of plus 0.32. Then we got the aim down sight speed of negative 0.15. I mean, this is very, very good. Even though I was aiming slow. I mean, at least it helped a lot, you know what I'm saying? I could have just aimed down, like, go all the way down more to aim, aim quicker, though, for real, though. But I just kept like this. So it's very, very good. But you got to right there. Damage, range, accuracy, and I could say a little bit recoil control. But it's very, very good to try it out. With the muzzle, we got that RF Crown 50. This is actually a good muzzle. I love using this. Not all the time. Sometimes I switch up. But you got to right there on the pro. Got the hair on the recoil control. Very good recoil control. This actually helped a lot because it's all about recoil, you know? And uh, plus, I does have... Uh, aimed out sights on with this too but at the same time even though i told you guys about the barrel i was aiming quick or like aiming slow a little bit slow though but even though i was winning gunfights losing gunfights but at the same time this is actually a good muzzle but if you guys don't know what hair is on me and very me hair is on me lower down very me rise up i mean it's very very good to try it out show you guys tune up so the tune up we got the aimed out sight speed of negative 0 0.67 then we got the gun control of plus 0 0.27 and it's all about recoil like i said it's very, very good to try it out with the magazine, we got the 44 round magazine. I could have just used the 30 rounds, but 45 rounds, I mean, on shipping, you get more kills, get a lot of kills, but it actually have a lot. But you got to get to right that. It kind of decreased of the mood speed and outside speed and reload quickness and sprint the fire speed. But at least you could try your best to hide somewhere because on shipment, it's crazy. Spawns crazy. I mean, it's what it is, what it is though, but try that 45 round magazine. If you're playing shipment, get a lot of kills though, for real. Though. Try it out. Or you can use the 60 round if you feel like it. Uh, with the rip grip, we got the brim flash grip. This is actually a good rip grip. I can tell right there on the pro. Got that sprint the fire speed and outside speed. Kind of decrease of the recoil control, but this is actually good. So I can aim quicker and sprinting fire speed and stuff is very, very good. And it's all about accuracy, so not recoil. So yeah. Uh, you got to tell right there. Got the recoil steadiness of plus 0.74. I mean, even though I said that, but I mean, you don't see no recoil. So it's just, just like they just normal like that's what i'm trying to say uh aiming stability got the plus 0 0.32 and uh yeah got a little bit accuracy but it's good and then with the stock we got the burn r90 factor this is actually a good stock i mean i could have used this while no stop but it's actually good got to turn it on the pro got that aiming walking speed sprint speed and recoil control so this is a good start because I could aim walking speed, I could sprint speed to like, you know, what I just play like uh, domination or whatever like that stuff, you know. Then I got recoil control, it really helped a lot for real though. I mean, to myself, I be thinking like, wait, hold on. The recoil control really help a lot, but even though the stock does not have a recoil control on the pro, so on the con it does, but even though I was, you know, you know handle recoil like that, but like I'm trying to say is I don't have no underbarrel, but at least we got a barrel and I could say a muzzle to help out with the recoil. You know, even though, like I said, on the rip grip, it does have 
you know, sprint to first speed, ain't on tight speed, you know. But if I could have the D37 grip on her, then everything could be good. But other than that, I just like to switch up. But yeah. And uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys, oh, yeah, I'll yeah, show you guys tune up. Uh, the tune up on this, we got the ain't on tight speed of negative 2.32. Then we got the walking speed of negative 1.47. And it's all about, you know, like I can say, recoil. Yeah, so try it out. And I can say mobility as well, because I got ain't walking speed, sprint speed as well. So free free try this class. So let me know in the comment below. You guys drop more kills with this gun. With this class up, I'm telling you guys, the gameplay was crazy, even though I was kind of pissed off. But I mean, you, if you guys know what shit, you should know everybody grind camos. I mean, if I die, people going for three kills all the time. I mean, it's with his whiz, though. I mean, everybody get pissed off when they trying to get gameplays and stuff like that on shipment, but. Is what is what is though. Or people get pissed off when they trying to get three kills while dying, or trying to go for headshot when they trying to get the Potomac camo to a ran camo. You know, yeah. But yeah, I'm going to the fire rate to show you guys this. But like I said, M13B, this gun is so good, and I, I love. I don't know why I just love using the phase camo on every gun because I mean, I should start using them. You know, why not? I mean, I love using a ran camo and Potomac camo on my guns, but. I mean, it, it's good. It ain't no really worth nothing to worry about that for it though. As long as I just use it, if I feel like I'm gonna use it, I, I, I don't want to use it then. I mean, it depends on man. But let me know in the to drop more kills with this class slip with M13B. Crazy, got a buff in season three. You guys gotta try this class slip, man. Drop a like if you're new. See you guys next time.